Well, hello, people. I am Astrath, and welcome to a brand new Let's Play. Welcome to this. Disney Interactive. Disney and Ubisoft. So you got Good Company and Disney and Phoenix Interactive. At least we can choose a language. Let's go for Netherlands or Nederlands. Nope, we're going to do English. Welcome to Let's Play Winnie the Pooh's Rumbly Tumbly Adventure. Um, I'm not joking. I am not joking here. Let's play. Oh, it's Winnie the Pooh. Okay, so we can control Winnie the Pooh here. A few people that don't know Winnie the Pooh was a... God, it's, it's been a novel, a book, which is the same thing, a film, children's TV show, CGI TV show, animated, um, you've had like teddy bears or whatever, probably this music went on iTunes, whatever, but yeah, um, it was a very good, it was actually one of my favorites when I was younger, laugh if you want, but you know, all of, everyone in this life sort of will have a soft spot for Winnie the Pooh, won't they? Anyway, let's play the game! So, this is for the Game Boy Advance. Uh, it was also released, I believe, for the GameCube, but I'm playing the GBA version. New game! On a not-so-blustery day in a hundred-acre wood. Nah, you see, it should be blustery. You know, never mind. Winnie the Pooh and Christopher Robin decide to climb a tree. Again. Oh, bother. There's a rumbly in my tumbly. You're always hungry, Pooh Bear. Why don't you try thinking of something else? That's a very good idea, Christopher Robin. But what shall I think about? Yeah, I can't do a good Winnie the Pooh impression. I'm sorry, guys. Well, you can remember some of your favorite times. Oh, yes. Now, think, think, think. My favorite times are often at birthday parties. Oh, I know, just the perfect thing. And so Pooh decided to remember those birthday parties by looking at his friends. Birthday scrapbooks. I'm shocked he didn't think, 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 honey, or think, think, food. Just something to do with food. You'd have thought that, anyway. Ah, well. We can control Winnie again. There are certain scrapbooks you can see. There are pictures on these signs. Ooh, that one's glowing! To Piglet's birthday scrapbook. Let's go to Piglet's scrapbook, shall we? Oh god, it's Gopher. Now, to forget about his appetite, Pooh remembered the de birthday of one of his very dear friends. It's Piglet's birthday today, so I must go and wish him a very happy birthday. Say there, Sonny! If you want to go see Piglet, you'll have to open the gate first. Just use the key that's on the tree stump. Pick up logic's pressing A. Thank you, Gopher. Okay, where's the stump? There it is. Key! Uh, uh. Got the key, the iron key. Ooh, he's getting a bit, uh, you know, specific, isn't it? Stupendous! Now all you have to do is use it to open the gate. To use an object, press L or R. Okay. There's the key. So you might as well use it. What can Winnie the Pooh actually do? Well, he can walk around. These things, we are going to punch. Winnie the Pooh is kicking and punching. What is... He, ki he just punched a bush. He punched a bush. But Winnie the Pooh punched a bush. He is evil. Evil Winnie. He just belly bounced a, 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 a bush. A, a, can I get those? I can't even get them. Try again. No, I'm not getting anywhere with these. Ah, there's one. Come on. Go back into the whatever the hell that is. Just so I can punch you or kick you. There you go. As you can see, if something sparkles whatever, we can collect it. We can collect honey pots. So, let's just punch and kick. Well done, you've collected all the honey pots in this spot. Press select to see how many honey pots you've collected. Okay. We've collected ten. From this area alone. Which is the highest amount we can get here in this one scene. 
So let's do is go for Cess finally and go and open the door. It seems to be locked. See, this gate to be locked. And oh bother. It all seems I don't have the key. But we do, Winnie. We do have the key. Spectacular. Now you're ready to go see Piglet. To find where you are on a mini map, press select. Um, okay, we should be fine, but let's just make sure. Select. Okay, that's where we are. The big flashing yellow dot, as you can probably tell, is Winnie the, is Pooh Bear. So, we're good. We know where we are. Right. More sadistic kicking and punching of bushes. Winnie, you are evil. Punch and kick. And eat the honey pots. Eat the honey pots. Belly bounce the honey pots. I don't know whether I should be happy that I'm playing this game or not, because I'm afraid they're gonna do something which is just gonna make me forget like everything I know about Winnie the Pooh from my past and just remember this only. Anyway, well done, you found all the honey pots this spot. So I believe there are ten in every area, which is okay. Winnie the Pooh walking well, he looks like he's drunk, doesn't he? He's even sort of wobbling when he's standing still. Uh, give me another one, you jerk. No oh, bother. Anyway, let's go to next area. Oh, it's Kanga. Hello, Kanga. Why, hello, Pooh Bear. Are you going to visit Piglet today? Oh, yes. Today is his birthday, and I thought it'd be a perfect day to pay him a birthday visit. But you see him every episode. Anyway, <clears throat> do be careful, dear. One of the planks is missing on the bridge to his house. It might need to be replaced. Okay, so... On the way to Piglet's house, there is a thingy my flarv. Check to see if there's any honey pots. Aha! Let's kick it! I just punched a honey pot. See, in my day and age, Winnie the Pooh's to eat honey. Not punch it, but never mind. Ooh. Uh Oh hey, gopher. My paths! Blocked. You'll have to push this box out of the way, my friend. To push objects, use the directional buttons. Will do. Let's push. Superb. Now the path is clear as a whistle. Yes, it is, isn't it? Okay. What the hell? Say there, Sonny. That tummy of yours is making much noise. Those heffalumps might have heard you coming from a mile away. They'll be after you for sure now. Oh, bother. I don't suppose you know how to frighten away a heffalump? Of course I do. I'm an expert. You'll find, uh, just find a balloon and pop it. Pop it, yes. That'll sure to make them run away. Find a balloon and pop by pressing the A button. Remember, don't let the heffalumps touch you. You can hear the heffalumps as well. There they are. You can hear them. Where are they? Where's my balloon? There's a heffalump! Pop! You go first. Super! If I do say so myself. Now you can sightsee without any worries. Don't forget, if those heffalumps come near after you again, just find yourself a balloon and pop it! Thank you, gopher. Okay, so let's kick uh, bushes and get honeypots out of it. No, I want that one. Thank you. And walk like we're drunk. So you see, Drunk Pooh has just come back from his 18th birthday party. Or if you're in America, 21st. Oh, bother. I cannot pass the bridge. There is a wooden plank missing. Can't you jump over it? it uh, you could use your slightly large body as like a... A bridge or something, could you, Winnie? Come on, Pooh Bear, you... Ugh, never mind. Just collecting honey pots. Why not? I don't know how many honey pots I need for it. I believe the honey pots do have a... Oh, Lord. Say, I bet those bees are stopping you from passing by. Well, you've come to the right place. I found that the way to make them skedaddle, all you have to do is bring them the number of honey pots they're asking for. All right, that's what you need them for. Honey pots? I don't suppose you know where I could find some honey pots, that is. I certainly do, they're everywhere. You're sure to find some. If you shake the shiny objects, 
by pressing A, you'll uncover honey pots, which you've already been doing. Alright. What do you want, you stupid bees? Spectacular, all the bees have skedaddled. Next time they bother you, just bring them more honey pots. Thank you, gopher. There's my password. Thank you. Okay, let's keep going. Hmm. What do I do with this, by any chance? So yeah, this game is slightly puzzle-based, I guess you could say. Not much, but a little bit. Aha! That's all our honeypots for this screen. Nice. Okay, so where I need to go is there, but I don't have the plank yet. So let's go and get the plank. I can see one plank, he's called Gopher. Man, I don't think there's many Winnie the Pooh characters that I got got annoyed with. Probably uh, Rabbit I wasn't really fond of. Rue I didn't like. Um, but yeah, Tigger, great. Winnie, great. Piglet was okay. Eeyore, pff. how can you go wrong with Eeyore? I'm sorry. Okay, more honey pots there. Yeah, he's a manic depressive, but come on. They all have their own problems. Okay. What's wrong here? Think, think, think. Oh, yes. Perhaps I should make a bridge to reach the wooden plank. Okay, so the plank is over there. Which means we need to find a way to get it. Hmm. Well, there's Kanga. We don't want to go see Kanga yet. Actually, we've already gone and seen Kanga. So, we need that wooden plank. We've gone down there. Nothing. I tell you, Pooh's getting a lot of exercise here by just walking around. He's getting a lot of exercise right here by just walking. Fair on you, Pooh, fair on you. Okay, so it's got to be over here somewhere, I believe. Alright, that's where we need it to go. What's that? Oh, I thought that was the bridge piece we needed. Damn you. I mean, worked up for nothing. Okay, I'm checking all the outside parts. There must be something to do with that. Oh, it's not one of those ones where I gotta pretty much carry it throughout the whole place. Well, I ruined that, didn't I? Actually, no, I didn't. I'm good, I'm good. Okay, so I can't push it there. I must have to push it down. Come on, Pooh. Where the bloody hell does this go then? It's just a waste of time. Aha! Oh, I see, I see. It's a. Uh, it makes a raft. Two. Oh, what a surprise! And it stops there. It stops halfway through a current. Okay, well now we can collect the wooden plank. Lovely. <laughs> Come on, Pooh, collect the plank. Show it to the other plank. It's gopher. Wooden plank! Congratulations, Pooh, now you can repair the bridge. What, what, where the hell do you come from? So how do you know I've got the plank? Where did the Pooh there go? Get out my head, get out my head. Damn you, Kanga. Never liked you that much either. Hmm. Hey, Pooh Bear, let's uh, repair the bridge. Use the plank. That's a small plank. Not okay. It seems to have enlarged into a bigger plank. Maybe it's made of like uh, sponge or something. Anyway, so that's the first sort of puzzle complete. Let's kick more honey pots. Get that. I believe there are ten in each area. I believe. I'm not too sure about it. But um, we will belly bounce and punch and kick because we are Pooh Bear and we are the destroyer of men, eater of honey pots and honey. Actually, no, he doesn't. He doesn't bother with the honey. He just goes and eats the pot. Yeah. Okay. That's another ten. Oh no, there seem to be more. There's more. Ooh. Okay, here's another little puzzle. Um, seems like a pretty easy one though. Uh, apparently. Yeah, I'm 
Really? I don't have to push that? I'm sure I have to push that. Maybe not. Hmm. Well, that's a bit irritating. Uh, I can't go up that way yet, can I? Nope. Prevents you from going that way. That's the way I've just turned up, so let's go back. I'm starting to get lost here, but yeah, it's a puzzle game, so I probably will get lost a little bit. Right, back, hit no, it doesn't reset. Hmm. Can't push this one either. Well, it looks like I can't go through there. Let me through! I am Winnie. Let me through and you will... Or you'll perish to my bulk. Ah. Anyway, guys, I believe I'll leave it here. But in the next episode, Pooh Bear goes to Piglet's birthday thingy. There's no stopping Winnie the Pooh. I'll see you then.